This is a painting of my son, Brandon Burry. It's my son, Philip. Jeremy was our oldest son. Philip was killed in Afghanistan, 18th of August, uh, 2005. He was 26 and he was killed in uh, Afghanistan. As they were driving along, uh, they ran over an IED. On a quiet street in an old downtown behind an unassuming storefront, you'll find a monument to heroes. Each portrait depicts a fallen soldier, a child who will never return to parents like Brent and Carla Burris, Brian Burry, and Carson George. But even though their children are gone, one dedicated volunteer has adopted them all. Those are my boys. I come in every morning. I talk to Shane Martin over there. He was an artist. And I walk in the door and I say, guess what, Shane? We get to paint today. Ken Pridgen calls them his boys and girls, portraits he's painted of Texans killed in Iraq and Afghanistan. What started as a one-time favor snowballed into an ambitious goal memorialize every Texan lost in our current wars. Now downtown Baytown is home to the Portrait of a Warrior Memorial Gallery. The ultimate goal is to have 500 families come to Baytown, Texas on Texas Avenue to see their loved one on the wall, see me over here painting, and say, son, would you paint a portrait of my son like that? And I said, yes, sir, that's what I do. The gallery features two ongoing projects. Portraits, painted for any family who requests one, line the sides. Down the middle, a mural wall features photos of the deceased. Every stroke and every line is hand-painted by Ken himself. With more than 500 Texans already killed, it's a monumental task that demands all of his time. I, I get up about 6.30 and I come over here and have a cup of coffee and I start painting till about 8, 9 at night. And then I go home and I, and I work on this wall. I am so fortunate. Do you realize I get to do exactly what I want to do? all day long. Sometimes I forget to eat. Supposedly, Ken is retired, but he works harder now than he ever did during his career as a commercial sign painter. Typical days include 14 hours of painting plus research and planning at night. But once Ken saw what this meant to people, there was no turning back. I couldn't quit if I wanted to. There would be no way. How could you quit when you're given a mission like this? Every time I do one of these, I do it as well as I possibly can do it. Every time. Not just haphazard this or haphazard that, or maybe that'll be okay. No, it's got to be just right, okay? That's because she deserved that. Ken does more than simply paint a picture. He gets to know each and every person on that wall. Their personalities, hobbies, and favorite memories make it into the final image. And when each masterpiece is complete, Ken humbly presents the family with their own edition. It's his way of helping parents cope with their greatest nightmare. Thank you so much. Thank you for your service. Thank you for your son's service. This, this painting made me proud of my son and, and so gr grateful for Ken for painting it. Oh, thank you, Ken. That's nice. It's beautiful. 
Thank you very much. You're quite welcome, sir. You can remember the character they were, the type of person they were, what they aspired to, and continue your mission to complement that. It's a great uh, memorial, uh, uh, a way to honor uh, him, and not only him, but all the, you know, that have given the sacrifice. And I'm really, I'm really glad that the Lord brought Ken this idea, mm -hmm. uh, and it's 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 just awesome to to see that that Ken is willing to dedicate his life to to memorializing our guys. This painting it it brings to life. Uh, a, a soul that is lost. And I don't know whether you looked at these boys or not, but they look back at you. With nothing more than brush and canvas, Ken Pridgen sends a heartfelt message. Every soldier deserves our attention. His portrait of a warrior gallery honors those who survive by remembering those who do not. And for our nation's sons and daughters, that's the most powerful tribute of all. This is, uh, this is so awesome. This is more than about just my son, or this son, or that son, or that daughter. It's about uh, a nation of heroes and their lives, being up here, their lives still make a difference as long as we don't forget.